for that here. Case file number 117, The Revisit, Entity Leave, Conclusion, Private Investigation in Burwick, Pennsylvania. You're going to start off with a simple Our Father prayer. You guys can recite it with me if you know it. If not... Welcome back to the conclusion of our Revisit investigation of our case in Berwick, Pennsylvania. During our opening prayer in part one of this revisit, we noticed someone or something mumbling at the top of the stairwell. Soon after, we witnessed something on the SLS camera. A figure, something at the top of the stairs. Will we make contact with it? Let's continue with the investigation. It's, ice cold to find it. It, it's right there. It's ice cold right here. You can feel it. You're a very cold fish. I was just talking up there and this spirit clearly came out of the box and said, I don't care. Well, you don't care. You still haven't given us your name. How about... I gave you my other name. All right. Could you please tell us your Christian name? Steven, you have one standing in front of you now, too. So there's one on the end of the bed, and there's one standing in... That, that one's gone now. Can you tell us your Christian name? Can you hold in the other one? He's not being up there. What? Who was that, Joey? What'd you say? Where did you go? It's not there now. Where the hell did it go? I don't think it can travel. I still say it. It's not there. What? Where'd you want to talk at? Right here. All right. It's not there now. Huh? Are you still in this room? <laughs> Timmy, okay. So you've still not told us your Christian name. Standing right in front of you. Are you washed in the blood of the Lamb of Jesus Christ? Yes or no? Hear my story. We don't want your story. We're just asking you. 
Were you baptized, yes or no? Yes, sir. It's on the end of the bed again. Do you know who this is on this necklace? Can you tell me who these people are? Side of you, and it was taller than the hill. 
Give me the chills that was so tall. Sorry. Look at something's on the edge of the bed. Yeah, over here on this corner. Brittany, when you just touched the back of your neck, there was a giant saw or that went into your left ear out to the right. As I thought said, I felt something. As you felt that, he, he saw it. Yeah. Where did you go? Nothing on the bed is going. Fallen Angel, what is your name? That just said that I'm not terrified. Purified or terrified? That's Tammy. That's Brittany. Can we try something? Yeah. yeah. Almost noble prince of the angelic hierarchies. <laughs> Valorous warrior of Almighty God. Zealous lover of his glory. Terror of the rebellious angels. Love and delight of all the just ones. My beloved Archangel St. Michael, desiring to be numbered among your devoted servants, I today offer and consecrate myself to you and place myself, my family, and all I possess under your most powerful protection. Wow. I entreat you not to look at how little I as your servant have to offer, being only a wretched sinner. But the gaze rather with favor believe at the heartfelt affection with which this offering is made. And remember that if from this day onward we are under your protection, you must during all my life protect me and those I love. That was just growling the whole entire time you were reading that. Actually, Michael, the whole time he was reading that. The uh, EMF detector is uh, going from red to yellow to uh, is all over the place. It's going I, just, I just saw that, and the last thing that that box just said was, you're going to suffer. Still going off. What is that sound? It sounds like something choppy. It's an airplane it's outside. It's a helicopter outside. Guys, the walkie, uh, I can't see it. Or the, uh, the baby monitor. Look over there. See if it does anything with that too. Gracious something. You still have not told us your name. You are asking. Anybody know a George? He did, but he wasn't there. George Past was life. George of the jungle? Or, yeah, in the past, yeah, but. It's just not on the end of the bed. Oop, that was Brittany. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna shut this off and turn it back on, see if it does it again. <laughs> So like I said, let me go, you stupid. I thought it was like push control, stupid. You just had a light, like, uh, not, I don't know, maybe you got it on camera, but it looked like, not that, but it looked like something. All right, let's outside. see. No, it's, it's still... Make that light up. Make it stop. My phone's down to 14%. Wow. How's the camera? I and you're still full. Still going off. Oh my god, that hurt. <laughs> Are you on the edge of the bed now? It's still, that's still going off. Yeah, there's nothing over there. Yep. It's sort of like from the corner where he was and he's stretching. Now he's gone. Oh my goodness. You can come back. Come talk to us. Did you like the prayer? Can you make something move? Did you like the prayer? Oh, let's try the prayer again. We'll do it a little differently. Let's see what this clown does. Let's see. Do 
you have something paranormal or unexplained in your home or place of business in West Central Florida, you can contact us by sending an email to paranormaltravelers at gmail.com. Our investigations are completely free and confidential. You can check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and you can watch all of our past and current episodes on our YouTube channel. Contact us today. We have Sonny trying once again with the prayer to see if the entity leaves him alone while reciting it. So let's continue. Just there. A little bit of a thing that it just said just now, maybe when you look down. Don't quote me on it, but it kind of said, sounded like it said Plymouth. Very low. Plymouth? No, it said my name. No, Plymouth. Like Plymouth. Are you keeping him from saying it again? It's laying long wise on the bed. Which way? No wonder why that's going on. Its head is down towards you, its feet are up on this side. All right, hold on. Keep it, keep it in your life. And it's bigger than what it was. Well, it's about to be smaller. Just have to get to the right frame. Where is it? Uh, its arm is dangling off the corner of the bed. Towards me? Yep. O most noble prince of the angelic hierarchies, valorous warrior of almighty God and zealous lover of his glory, <laughs> terror of the rebellious angels and love and delight of all the just ones, my beloved archangel Saint Michael, desire to be numbered among your devoted servants. I today offer and consecrate myself to you and place myself, my family, and all I possess under your most powerful protection. It's touching your hand there. I entreat you not to look at how little I as your sinner have to I as your servant have to offer, being only a wretched sinner, but to gaze rather with favor believe at the heartfelt affection with which this offering is made. And remember that if from this day onward I am under your patronage, it's, you must during all my life assist me. It's trying to rip your phone out of your hand. Procure for me the pardon of my many grievous offenses and sins. The grace to love with all my heart, my God, my dear Savior Jesus, and my sweet Mother Mary. And obtain for me all the help necessary to arrive at my crown of glory. It's gone. Defend me always from my spiritual enemies, <clears throat> particularly in the last moments of my life. Come then, O glorious Prince, and succor us in our last struggle. And with your powerful weapon cast far from us into the infernal abyss, that provocator and proud behind angel, you. that one day you prostrated in the celestial battle. St. Michael, defend us in our daily battle so that we may not perish in the last judgment. In the name of the Father, right in front of you, right in the front Son, of you. and of the Holy Spirit. We are not afraid of you. That's gone. Wow, that was... Now it's laying back in the same spot on the bed. Oh my goodness. You playing with us. And you just put that down and it's gone. Come on over here. You don't oh. like that, do you? Nope, does not like it. You don't like that, do you? It's not going anywhere. That's laying there again. Are you okay. mocking him? EMF stopped. <laughs> It's like punching your hands. You don't like that, do you? That's kicking you. Kick and now you line. have this giant thing behind you, and... You don't like that, do you? What the hell is that? And it's gone. Yep. Just that I'm coming for you. Well, we're here.
We're here for you. And everything's gone. The room definitely has a lot of board activity going on in this show. Oh, a pretty active room tonight. Yeah. Now that we can see where you're at. I mean, not to mention, but that room has a camera in it, so it can join 24 seconds or 24 minutes a day or whatever, but you have no camera in your room. Nope. Nope. I'm sleeping with yeah. Joey. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's all the equipment there. Okay, as I said, it looks like all footprints. That means if you die, you can't tell how. <laughs> that was amazing. Brittany has a tall, shaded figure. It's not a stick figure, but tall, shaded thing behind her. Like, really slender. I keep getting a headache in between my eyes. It's like a tall, dark shadow. It's not a stick figure, though. And now it's gone. Never mind. You're desperate, that's right. You know you can't win this battle. The mirror looks like there's, with the, with the SLS, the mirror looks like there's a, one of those haunted things with blood coming down out of the mirror. Mm -hmm. It's freaky. You never told us why you're here. I'm laughing. What's funny? Oh, I hit the thing and it went off. <laughs> How many are you? How many are your numbers? It's getting ready to say something. Can you say that again? That's good. Hmm. So if you don't like St. Michael, you don't like prayer, you don't like Jesus or the saints, then what the heck are you doing in this house? Come on, answer it. It's going. Tell us why you're here. Exit the home and get out. I think it's time for you to leave.
say it now. That may be another angle. It keeps going off. Yeah. Turned. They say. Happy no, we got retired to rest. We're trying to rest. That looks clear as day. Yeah. No, I'm trying to rest. Where are you trying to rest? Because I don't see you on the bed. Tell us where you are. Tell us where you are so we can keep talking to you. We want to know your name. So we can address you properly. That's cute. That's what I thought I said. That's <laughs> cute. Thank you. <laughs> okay, too quick going off. Yeah. Hmm. How many archangels are there? Yeah, you do know. What are the names of the archangels? Whoa. Rick, when you were just shining over, they had a clear day orb right in front of them. Was it? As you had your camera over top of them. <laughs> there was an orb on camera, clear as day. What are the names of the archangels? Come on, name them. Hello? You're not in here. Who else fell with you? <laughs> Come on, wake up. Speak a little louder. something paranormal or unexplained in your home or place of business in West Central Florida? You can contact us by sending an email to paranormaltravelers at gmail.com. Our investigations are completely free and confidential. You can check us out on Facebook, 
Twitter, and you can watch all of our past and current episodes on our YouTube channel. Contact us today. Michael and I decided to have a few team members spend some time in the guest bedroom. Unfortunately, only one video survived due to the footage turning corrupt. So let's continue the investigation. Okay, I need a chain and a flashlight to get downstairs. <laughs> oh, come on! How am I gonna get downstairs? So, when you need help or whatever, I'll call you and we'll come up and get you, okay? Good luck. Alright. Not yet. Don't start until I tell you to. Well, no. Oh my god, never mind. Just your room got so dark. Well, yeah. Joey! <laughs> Still can't hear anything. Can you hear me? You want to fix the baby monitor, Tammy? Uh, yes, Tammy, fix the baby monitor. Uh, sure, if I could see. Still can't hear a single thing you're saying. Oh, wait, there we go. Can you hear me now? Nope, come back out. You have to push the baby monitor off the side with the tape really tight. How about now? Yes, we can hear you. Still? Nope, it's all off again. Oh. I'll be open in a second. Yes, be nice. There's a beautiful orb that just shot from your back. Wow, Tammy, you should see how black it got behind you. That's pretty cool. Oh, I can't get the monitor. Okay, well I have Boo Buddy on and he's talking already. Is there anybody here with me?
Can you tell me your name? I'd like to know your name. Are you holding Boo Buddy's hand? Can you tap on the wall? Sammy, we're having technical difficulties, or difficulties up there right now. The walkie or the, the baby monitor went off. Can you go over to it and push the baby monitor again? Good. Get it to go. Here. 
Are you coming to the edge of the bed? I saw you light up. It likes Boo Buddy, whatever this is. Well, I hope so. Or does that mean, does that mean Boo Buddy is making noise for not damn right? Yeah. Was that something you just went through the screen? That's what I thought I saw. Like something like across it. Was it lighter behind the It was black. Tammy, you're getting that wrong. Are you a little girl? Ooh, I just saw a bright flash. That's good. It's trying to make connection with you. It might even try to manifest itself to show you it. I saw a green one. Right? Yeah. That's bright. Mental. Right? Yeah, but you don't need mental. Okay, Mikey. Come here now. Why? What's going on? Um, I see a figure in the corner and I went out. Oh, just hold off for like two more minutes. Just try to hold off. You got this. It's not hurting you. It's just standing there. That's what it's doing. It's not bothering you. Just remember, it can't hurt you. If it's anything like the minor that used to bother me at my house, you're fine. Tammy? Yes. Take a deep breath. You're still alive. It's not hurting you, correct? Correct. It's just trying to scare you. So look at it and tell it you have no power here. No goodbye. You have no power here. You can leave. Is it still there? Yes, it's still there. Does it look like it's coming closer to you? No. Well, that's good, though. You're fine. Ten more minutes, right, Tammy? Joey? Are you trying to tell me your name through Boo Buddy? Come on, make this equipment light up. Do something. Standing in the corner is not bothering me. Have something paranormal or unexplained in your home or place of business in West Central Florida? You can contact us by sending an email to paranormaltravelers at gmail.com. Our investigations are completely free and confidential. You can check us out on Facebook, 
Twitter, and you can watch all of our past and current episodes on our YouTube channel. Contact us today. Michael and I decided to have a few team members spend some time in the guest bedroom alone. Unfortunately, only one video survived due to footage turning corrupt. So let's continue this investigation here in Berwick, Pennsylvania. Come on, make this equipment light up. Do something. Standing in the corner is not bothering me. What you got here? Come on, light this up. Light this equipment up. See? Come on, light it up. Like this up. Show me what you got over here. Tammy, turn around and look at that mirror. It literally looked like it, there was green lights illuminating into the mirror. It's probably reflection of blue buddy. My fingers getting tired on the button. Alright, you're almost done. Switch fingers. I did. Are you going to come out and tell us your name or where you're from? What did you do as a living? Were you a minor? How old were you when you passed away? Do what? Go over to the door where you saw the figure standing and chant to it and say you're no longer welcome here. <laughs> Alright. Come on, make this sure that you do. It really looks good, buddy. If you're the evil thing here, you will not be welcome back here. Come on, light this stuff up. Show me what you got before I leave.
head just for a split second, right on the table. said wow oh, okay. fucking amazing I miss this thing Hi, can you wave? No, because I have to hold it right in front of me. Come on, make yourself appear again. As our night began to come to an end, I decided to put the REM master, which detects motion around it up to three feet away, in the spot where I was getting the stick figure from the SLS camera, Can you do it? which stands for Structured Light Sensor, allows us to see things that our naked eye cannot. What I captured is not only amazing, but astonishing, and to have our night vision camera running directly across from me proves that orbs can manipulate equipment that detect motion. Oh, you can do it. Thank you guys. Well, it's at energy now, because it still gets smashed. Come on, use all the energy in the batteries. Make it go off. Come on. Was that all the energy that you had? And I got sat here, and I told you, I'm like, I don't know, the equipment's going to start going off all over the place here at some point. What time sure. is that? What time is that? Is it past 12? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, definitely. 126. Yeah. Are you normally sleeping at 126? Oh, yeah. Wow, then that's 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 good because maybe it wants to show you now what it's really doing when you're sleeping. Well, we get an idea because we get up to go to the bed. I have some issues, but when I do get up, right, it's as if somebody's following you. Right. Like you feel that creepiness and stuff. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. And I'll make all those lights go off. And then when the cat is sitting in the hallway, just like staring at the wall, and you take a picture and you see what looks like a cryptid. Yeah, that's like, yeah. like, okay, so it's not just me. So is that all that you can do right now? Because I know you just need that. Well, you got to remember, it takes so much for a spirit to make something like that go. So it used all of its energy. So it's going to probably bump back 
and then come forward again. Can you do that again? Is that it? Keep going, do it again. Keep going. It's an orb. See, I'm looking at it and there's nothing around it. I look through my camera on my phone and there's something buzzing around it. Come on, make it light up all but the way. But I should way. be able to see a bug with my eyes looking right at it, Come on. right? Keep doing it. But it's buzzing around on my screen. But not in plain sight, so that that's an orb. Come on, make it light up all the way. Keep watching. Take the energy from this camera. I thought it was a bug. It's not. That's an orb sitting there. And now it's gonna start going off. There's no white light on that. No. There's there's a white light right there. Yeah, but look. Did I miss it? I'm gonna say the group prayer. May we be strong in its Lord, in its strength, and its might. Michael, the Archangel, defend us and be our protection against all evil and negativities on all levels. May you bless upon us with your divine white light and purify with all the love and occasion that you upon us put upon us. We ask that name in Jesus Christ that you protect us from any harm and cast all the negative energies, evil spirits at bay. In the name of Jesus Christ, we command you to go back to where you belong and bring peace to this house. I want you to repeat the prayer with me. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil from thy is the power and the glory forever and ever amen, amen. amen. this house portal is now closed we bring peace positive energy throughout the homes from the roof that stands from the four walls around from the basement from nooks and crannies crawl place spaces bless it all in the name of Jesus Christ, we command all evil spirits to go where they once came and be bound to the confines of this location. You are not allowed to follow us, to attach to any of our equipment, or to put any harm on all the or any of the homeowners. For that, in the name of Jesus Christ, we thank you. Amen. Amen. The portal is now closed.